to Pro Tour Philadelphia. Me, your host, Rich Hagen. I'm delighted to welcome for the first time to the show Antonio Fedon of Venezuela Thank in you. the uh, the red wine yeah. show, uh, uh, Vino, Vino Tinto. Tinto. Yeah. And t tell us about that. Is the Venezuelan team always in red? No, it's not red. It's okay. red wine. It's red it's wine. more purple uh, between uh -huh. red and purple. Okay. It's this color. Okay. And all the national teams yeah. can wear that color, right? Everybody. Okay. Well, here we are. We're going to talk about through the breach. It's a combo deck, boy is it ever. Let's get to the top of the table. Um, and we begin really with a, with a puzzle. I understand the four peer through decks here, and I understand yeah. the four preordain, and I understand the four ponder, that's fine. What's this one sleight of hand doing? <laughs> well, we wanted to play less land, so we said sleight of hand is the only card that makes you search mm -hmm. for only one mana. So we started at two, uh, we tested it, and then we said 18 land is too low. We gotta go 19 land and one slide of hand. Okay, so we have four, eight, 12, 13 ways to find stuff. Now, yeah. anytime you have a combo, you want to be careful that they're not gonna get in the way. Yeah. So t talk us through Giga Drows here. What's that for? Giga Drows can tap. Uh, blue lands and white lands that can uh, play Path to Exile to the mm -hmm. to one of my monsters yep. that we haven't seen yet. Uh, tap the blue lands for counters and it can gain you turns by tapping creatures that are going to attack you so to kill you. So it's like a you. fog? Yeah. Fog against zoo, something like that. Exactly. Okay, so let's say that end of turn we get to Giga Drows because Replicate, remember, one of those very powerful effects uh, from Ravnica block so you get to tap over and over uh, for each time you spend the blue. Yeah. At that point, the way is clear and we go on to our next row of cards and these are our rituals. Now, we've seen several deck techs this weekend with Rite of Flame or Rito de la Llama. Is that, how yeah. do you say it? Rito de la Llama. Yeah, I wasn't even close. Okay, then we have Seething Song over here or um, Cancion Hiraviente. You have a go. Cancion Hiraviente. I wasn't far off with that one. Yeah. And finally, we have Simeon Spirit Guide or Espiritu Guardian Simiesco. How was that? No. No. Espiritu Guardian Simiesco. Yeah. Okay, so anyway, there are rituals. That's not really a word. It's not really a word. <laughs> no, okay. Well, it's the Simeon thing, isn't it, I guess? Yeah. Um, so those are our rituals, and the magic number here is five. We start over here with Rite of Flame. Uh, with one mana, that turns into two, uh, and then you, if you play a second, then up you go, up the curve, you get to Seething Song, that's the biggie, because three will take you to the magic number of yeah, five. Magic Simeon number. Spirit Guide, you can just do straight away. It's a sacrifice, remember? You don't need any mana to get yourself going. I'll remove it from the hand. Remove it, that's right, yep, away it goes. Uh, so then we're at the magic number of five. So tell us yeah. what we do, Antonio, with our five mana. We play Through the Breach with through a the breach. fine mana. Here it is. Now, I'm not even going to try. Tell us what this says uh, in Spanish. In Spanish or in English? I in Spanish. So what's the name of the card in Spanish? Atravesando la brecha. Yeah, that sounds pretty funky. Um, through the Breach, it sounds pretty ordinary, but the way you did it was great. So yeah. now tell us what it does in the game for you. It puts a, card, a creature card from your hand into play. Mm -hmm. That creature gains haste and you sacrifice it at the end of the turn. With the new wording, it says uh, at the beginning of the next end step. End step, all right. So you can and cast it has this, yep. splice into arcane uh -huh. for four, only four mana. So if you get to nine mana. Or yep. if you play one of this. Okay. Which is an arcane spell. Sure, peer through that, you can splice it on there. It says arcano, arcano, and then two red, red, splice it on. So at that point, we've got our mana, we found a creature in hand. Let's look at what the creatures are. Now these, you will have seen any number of times this weekend already. Enrakul, the Eons Torn, or in Spanish... Enrakul, los Eones Desgarrados. 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 Oh, that's desgarrados. That's pretty awesome. You know what that does. But this guy, we haven't seen a lot of in any format. This is wonderful, a real addition to modern. Uh, so uh, tell us what this guy is in Spanish. Coloso de Acero Corrupto. 
that is Blight Steel Colossus. There you see it, 1111, Trample, Infect, Indestructible. Yeah. That's pretty awesome, pretty tough to deal with. Now, yeah. of course, 10 Infect is enough to kill them, yeah. but you need 20 life to kill them, and Emrakul only does 15. And That's of course, cool. you have to sacrifice it to Through the Breach. So, where does the rest of the damage come from? Usually, they deal it to, them, to themselves. Okay. Because of fetch lands, yeah. dual lands, uh, okay. Ravnica dual lands. Well, let's look at the mana base. We start off here with your basic islands. We go Hallowed Fountain along the road, and then you're into your Shivan Reefs, your Steam Vents. Further we go, across and across and across, and then uh, you're looking at your Misty Rainforests, all those lands that, oh, ow, that hurt me, one life point up, one life point off. And of course, eventually, you can even cast a Simeon Spirit Guide and yeah. just beat them for two a couple of times, right? It happens. Okay. Now, um, at this point, Antonio's only lost one round uh, in seven, so he's six and one uh, with this deck. And part of the reason for that, um, I believe there is a turn one kill with just six cards. Yes, So can is. you show me the turn one kill? What do we need? So, we need the Colossus. Okay, because that's going to be the It's straight, the only one that can kill because oh, it's not going to be at 15 yep. in the first turn. All right. So then, what else are we on? Do we, do we need any land at all? We could have land. Okay. We, we have... A we need this, breach. of course. Yes, so that's number two. And now we need five mana. The easiest okay. way... Yep. Is this way? Seething Song, yeah. So that's so we're, we're sort of reverse engineering this. Yeah. You, you keep going. And you oh, either okay. need two of this. Yep. So let's. Yep. One of this. All right. So let's oh. let's turn these around, and this is how we're going to go. So you imagine sitting down against Antonio here. You talk a little bit about the shirt. Good luck to you. Welcome to the Pro Tour. Yeah. Great stuff. And he goes, okay, I'll play with no lands. With no lands. He says, I'll, I'll, I'll keep this as my mulligan to six. First of all, remove. I'll remove that. From the game. So yeah. now I have one red mana. Yeah. Step two, Rite of Flame. Two red mana. I'm up to two. On he goes. I cast this. I have one in the pool. Yep. It gives me two plus three. So you're up to three now. And then you go two and a red. That's the three. Yeah. Down it comes. Four, five. Five mana. And then through the breach. Through the breach. I Colossus. will give Light Steel Colossus Haste. Attack. Turn it sideways, trample, infect, you for 11. And that, boys and girls, is the turn one kill in modern with yes, it is. Through the Breach. Antonio, that's just a great day. You're obviously doing very nicely. Just before yeah. we finish, tell me a little bit about magic in Venezuela. We don't get a chance to yeah. talk much about it. Um, I, I guess you're from uh, Valencia, is that right? So yes. that's the, what, second city? For magic, the third largest city in the country. Okay. Mm -hmm. And capital would be Caracas. Okay. Is the capital. That's so, where we usually have our PTQs. Mm -hmm. uh, usually the nationals goes there. Okay. Uh, and did you qualify to PTQ for this? Yes. Okay. I went to Caracas. All right. I played uh, the, the band deck. Uh huh. Okay. Yep. That so, weekend they the, they banned it. The uh, Cowblade. Sure. Yep. You played. Four it was blades. the last last weekend that I could play. Before you could bring it. So just before Jason Stoneforge Mystic go away. Yeah. They win him a trip to the Pro Tour. My yes. final question. Tell me who built this deck because I know you have a good friend yes. who who helped you with this. Jose Nasif. He built the Not deck. Not Gabriel Nasif. No. Okay. Venezuelan. Yeah. Okay. His name spelled different too. Indeed. All right. So. There you have it, the turn one kill. It's through the breach. It's very simple deck, really. It's find the cards you need, make sure they can't do anything about it, ritual everything out, get to five, through the breach, kill you. Thank you so much. And thank you so much, thank Antonio Fedon from Venezuela. For Antonio, I'm your host, Rich Hagen, saying bye.